Well, Sebastian Rogers is one of six active Amber Alerts in our state right now. For other families with children on that list, they've been waiting years for their loved ones to be found. News 2's Corey Johnson spoke with one woman who says she still holds out hope the police will find her sister. I didn't get to I didn't get to know my little sister like I wanted to, you know, and so I never got that opportunity to even get to know her personality or anything. 13 years later, the case involving missing four month old Zaley Grace Fryer has gone cold. Zaley was reported missing when she and her mother Shauna disappeared from their Millersville home on May 1st, 2011. Then on May 7th, 2011, Shauna's body was found in the Cumberland River near the Cohen Street Bridge in Nashville. Her death ruled a homicide, but baby Zaley was still missing. It's a tragedy Desiree Fryer, Shauna's other daughter, who was 10 years old at the time, says will forever impact her. It was definitely hard for me. Um, when I found out, it was actually on Mother's Day, and so it was extra hard at that point. Then finding out that they can't find Zaley, and to this day, we don't know where she is. We don't know if she's alive. We don't know if she's okay, and if she was she's not going to be recognizable at this point. An Amber Alert is still active for Zaley, who would be a teenager now. I would love for her to be here. I would love to have that connection with my sister because I don't have any other family to have a connection with, you know? It's always in the back of my head, like, okay, like, where is she? Or if I see someone that could possibly even look like her, it's like, oh my God, like, could that be my sister? But I can't just walk up and be like, hey, you know? And, and I just... It's definitely made life harder for me. And in a 2018 interview with the Millersville Police Department, officials said they were working every lead possible in Zaley's case. Well, this is a this is a high priority case for this department. You know, any information we get or any leads that we get, we follow through them or follow up with them thoroughly. And we definitely want to bring closure to the family of, of Zaley as well as Shauna. If Zaley is still out there, detectives have preserved a part of Shauna's liver so they could get a DNA hit with a cheek swab. Even after more than a decade, Desiree says there's still hope that she's still alive somewhere. I pray that she's able to come home at some point and she is able to know her real family and who she really came from. Corey Johnson, News 2. And we also reached out to the Millersville Police Department to discuss the case. We have not heard back just yet.